Hey, <laughs> hey everybody, this is not a spring chicken, yes? Oh, wait a minute. Oh yeah, did anybody think Obama was sincere about his latest announcement? Was it all just to get votes? Well, for now, we're going to bring old Kim on with comments on the headlines of today. Warm at the same level he left it. I think there's something wrong with pot. Now he knows they turn it off. Yeah. Climber dies after 1,000 foot fall on Mount Hood. You know, BS says, duh. You know, generally a thousand foot and you hit the ground, you generally don't even survive long enough to tell them you died. Mm. And the gay Murphy Brown effect. Oh, yeah, that's so what, okay. Uh, it, it's the same thing as, um, you know, as, uh, you know, as George Bush's vice president, Daniel Quell, making a stupid statement about, uh, you know, abortion. This is what they're calling Obama's all of a sudden finding gay people. Well, okay, uh, I'm going to try to explain something that this morning that a CNBC a newsman said to one of Obama. And he's sending his third tier people out to promote his, uh, his latest agenda. They said, tell the President of the United States you already have those votes. It's the votes that you keep pissing off that you don't have. And he said, you're never going to get elected catering to the far left of your party. You have to go to the center. Mm -hmm. he, they said, he had, but Obama, President has no intentions of moving to the center. He, what, and what happens is he will double down now with something else because his last great announcement went nowhere. He did two announcements this week that they're laughing at. So look for him to do something else to double down again. <laughs> and the report, last fugitive nabbed in 95 Japan Gasu. I know, this is ridiculous. I mean, um, okay, what? Okay, my father was, my father was a motorcycle officer. He was actually, a, you know, part-time rent-a-cop for the LA Police Department. Uh, but my father said, that he would sit there and talk with the detectives, and uh, they'd say, for Christ's sake, if you do something, leave. Don't stay because they're going to catch you eventually. Somebody's going to, you know, you have no friends if you do something stupid in this world. And so what happens? Instead of the crook going, you know, like he, he did something in Japan, go to Korea, for Christ's sake. Go to Hong Kong. Go to, go to Russia. Don't stay in Japan. They'll catch you. It's a small country. And Rodney King found dead in a swimming pool. I know. I, uh, my father, my, I go back to my father, police officer, dead again. They said it's amazing how many people that get that piss off police officers end up dead sooner or later. Oh, really? Yeah. And um, Kevin Cost, oh, Nick, Kevin Costner was lawsuit brought by Stephen Baldwin. Yeah, they said basically if, um, Baldwin is suing because he didn't really... He, he got conned out of it. it. What happened was he left the thing too soon before it basically it was sold. It, 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 I think it was Kevin Costner. Baldwin brought Costner in and then Costner stayed and Costner ended up with more money. I mean, like I think Costner got six or seven times more money than did Baldwin. It was Baldwin's thing. But that's what happens if you walk. It basically resulted in Baldwin who was the dreamer and the planner having to go into bankruptcy and then the, the jury ruled against him in court, so... And Nick Wallen, Wallenda, old-fashioned daredevil. Okay, and you're not, okay, they had him anchored to the cable. When you know you can't fall no matter what, you actually can walk better on a cable. Ooh. It's more difficult when you know that you can fall, you, you're paying attention. All when, when you know that no matter what happens, you're, you, you're fastened to the cable, all you have to do is pull yourself back up and then uh, come across the line. It's, it, it was not a Walenda act. It was, the Walendas would have never, I mean, I've seen the Walendas fall many times. And Chowchilla bus napper wins release from prison. I know, see, there is no such thing as life without, um, life without parole in our country. I mean, so it was 45 years he was in jail, but he still got parole, and basically it is a cat, it, uh, what he did is a life imprisonment without parole on a federal kidnapping charge. You know, when you kidnap people, kids, move them from one spot to another, it's, all, it's, it's like the death penalty. They, they, he didn't get the death penalty because California didn't like it. But he got life without parole, which is, you know, you always get parole. They know that in, okay, why they don't have death sentences in other countries, they, uh, you know, um, in England and stuff, is because when you put a person in jail, they don't get out of jail. 
In this country, they get you out. And scientists disrupt cameras to Hawaiian seals. I know that this. Um, the, the, uh, I saw a thing that they, they they're putting cameras on squid now, so they can figure out what. So because they want to see what the squid are doing, so they strap a little. They put it in the in a tentacle or something, and then eventually it, it disintegrates. But uh, they've been doing that for ages. I mean, it's this Sunday, folks. It's a bad news day. And Romney, Obama immigration policy impedes permanent citizenship. Oh yeah, because as everybody's talking this morning, um, you, he has a million people out there that he wants to give the, the let stay in the country instead of being deported. They're all rushing out immediately. Monday morning there's going to be a hundred thousand people at the immigration departments with requesting work visas and knowing that they're not going to get citizenship but they are going to put their name on a list to where they know where they're at, and then as soon as their visa's up, they'll throw their rear ends out of the country. So it's an automatic deportation thing by getting yourself a work visa. And two planes spark F-15 scramble during Obama visit. I know, that's another that's when you're doing his Long Beach thing. I mean, this guy, oh. they said this man is spending so much money. <laughs> they're going to hit him up for this after the election. If he loses, they're going to basically drain his bank account like you cannot believe because you do not stiff the people of the United States for that sort of thing. He's, you know, he's flying his camp, their campaign trips. Those F-15s cost money to be put in the air. And police say murder suspect arrested at U.S. border. Yeah, that's, um, that was the guy, basically a military officer to wipe, to kill his ex, he killed his girlfriend and her boyfriend in the hospital. And then, at least he was trying to get to Canada, but you don't go through the checkpoints. You walk across the end of the, you know, it's like it got off a long border with no fences. You just pick a spot, walk across it. And 6.1 magnitude earthquake rocks the Philippines. Yeah, I would not want to live in the ring of fire for anything because that place is, you spend most, I live in California basically, it's bad here, but the big earthquakes are normal in the ring of fire. Mm. And Obama family makes rare trip home to Chicago. This is why BS is out. It's called B and S because the Obamas just a couple of weeks ago went home to spend the night. And when they went home to spend the night, they had to pull everybody out of the neighborhood. The whole area had to be moved out of because the president oh. was there. And then he went back home again, which meant, guess what? Everyone had to do again. See, here's the problem. Obama can never move back to his house because they cannot secure the house without removing everybody on both sides of him for blocks. Oh, and Greeks vote in critical election. Actually, the voting should be over now. The voting has been over here for three hours. They said they wouldn't know who the win were because even though they're doing it by hand, they still have, um, in Greece, the law is everyone has to vote. So they go to certain places in a simple tally thing. You can count, you know, like, like they go, and there's the only thing going like this, and you know, here, 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 and once it goes here, 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 then you just, somebody packs this up, counts it, counts this, counts that. It's actually a god awful fast system. It's like the Chinese and their avatars thing. Mm -hmm. And Ryan's future in Romney White House or U.S. House? Well, not unless he's vice president, he's not going to be in that. Because he will lose his safe seat in Wisconsin to become a member of the Romney. They figure probably, um, you know, whatever it is, economic advisor, but will he give up a chance to be a senator, to be an economic... Cabinet members never become presidents. Mm. An Ohio woman drives in crowd and drink dozens. Yeah, you know, that's why people my age aren't allowed to drive anymore. <laughs> like in California, you get to my age, you got to take driver's test continually. Air, Air Force's mystery shuttle returns to Earth. Mm. It's so much of a mystery that every radar unit in the whole universe had the thing to test deal. But it seems like the Air Force is doing what Obama basically shut down. They're testing a new shuttle of their own. And a Monty bubbleism for the Mark Twain of the Animal Kingdom. For some reason, when you get to be my age, you find you can't work 24-hour days anymore.